in this tutorial i'm going to teach you how to create a complete content article using cloud ai so cloud ai is becoming increasingly popular with content writers especially article writers in past week because its ability to write humanized content is better than ChatGPT. so i will show you an article that i wrote using cloud ai before i get into the prompt so in this complete article i used cloud ai if you notice the tone and voice that it used to write the article you can definitely notice it's not chat gpt there's no word like multi-faced uh, in the realm of a digital landscape daunting there's no ai jargon but it's also linked out authoritative sources which is good so i will just skim through the article to just show you so this is a really good a comprehensive article that i used using the free version of cloud ai and now i'm going to teach you how to write a similar article with humanized tone using one single prompt using cloud so let's get to it so i will show you the prompt and i will share this in the description so you can download it and use it as you wish but please make sure to give me a subscribe and a like if you like this content and the if you want to see more of this so i will explain this prompt to you but first i'm going to copy it and then paste it into code ai we'll start a new chat And we gonna paste the prompt so I'm gonna explain only only the important parts of the prompt to save you some time because you can read this prompt in your own time uh, after you finish watching this article sorry after you watching this video I haven't writing too much articles <laughs> okay and so here first thing you can incorporate your keyword here if you have a keyword if you don't have a keyword you can uh, use uh, tools like uh, ChatGPT or Gemini to find a suitable keyword based on your topic and search volume so for now I'm going to use that this keyword to write the article so an important thing is that I mentioned that use everyday language avoid jargon and identifying concerns and questions your target audience has secondly I mentioned that I want you to write like a human Use a casual but sophisticated tone in style of a New York Times. So here you can change this if you want, but I write for a professional audience, so I use this uh, tone, like tone of a New York Times editor. And you can mention the English spelling that you want to use. And no fluff, nothing cringe, digital jargon like digital landscape. So and then i want you to link out to some authoritative sources to back the statements in the article and i just said it's it will improve my article trustworthiness as well and again i want to include my internal links into the article as well so here you can paste your internal links here if you have any i'm going to use uh, this these three is the internal links that i want to include in this article so I will paste that here and I will just uh, clean it up a little bit mm -hmm. okay now it looks fine and lastly if you have terms that you wish to use throughout the article to boost your rankings I definitely recommend using terms but for to save some time I'm not going to use the terms here so you can find the terms using tools like neuron writer or again chat GPT and I will make a separate video on this how to find these terms to write this article and it will boost your rankings in Google but for the sake of a video I'm not going to use this lastly most important thing is that you're going to ask write it write the article in parts so it can't really generate and complete article in one response if it does it's going to be short and that i don't want 
So I'm going to say use multiple generators to write the article, but let me know when you're finished. So I ask it to use, remember, uh, use tables, list, and other formatting when needed, and use a string spelling. So I did that to improve the re readability. Well, I noticed that Claude really doesn't use tables, but it used list well, so I don't think that's much of an issue. So this is the complete front that you can uh, customize it based on your needs. And then you just have to submit it to Claude and wait till then it gives a response. So this is uh, Cloud3 Sonnet and the free version. I'm not up upgraded into pro version yet and still it's very good to write an uh, article. See already, already you can see it started breaking down the complex items in the uh, list. See here, common corrections. It started with common corrections. I like that. I break down the text. It gives a short answer. It directly answers the questions first and then uh, proceeds to explain it in detail. Okay, it continues. So here you will see it links out to the authoritative sources as well. You can't really see the links here, but I will show you what happens if I copy paste it into a Google document. The only thing that I didn't like about this, uh, sorry, let me paste without the form with the formatting itself. The only thing that I didn't like about this uh, part is like they use the word daunting. That I, I don't really like that, so I'm gonna change it into tough. Because just when you see the word, you can say it's written. Otherwise, it's very good. So you can see it links out to the authority. So also, it's like okay, uh. Renault Junior and NSW Residential Sciences Act. So it's very good. It's also also giving our article credibility. And then we will proceed writing the article again. As you can see, yeah, we're breaking down the text a little very well. Okay, we're gonna copy that part as well. Here's the next section. So you see, you can see it links out of the resources again. We're gonna break down the text. And then it also uh, linked out to our internal links as well, very good. I'm very satisfied, Claude GPT not cloud gpt cloud ai so this is the prompt that i used to write the article it, you can see it's very quick and it saves you a bunch of times and then you can copy paste into your wordpress site or whatever blog you're posting and then it will create into a nice looking article like this so if you're wondering how do i create this infographics i will make a video on that right now as well so feel free to watch that and I will share this prompt with you in the comment section, sorry, uh, in the description. Uh, feel free to check that out and I will see you in the next video. Give me a like and subscribe and stay tuned. See you.